You got to be a goddamn fool to believe that Goods solely is responsible for Cassidy versus Goods reaching 2 million views in one week on YouTube after the battle was dropped on the URL app. You got to be a goddamn fool and completely delusional because Goods was AWOL leading up to the battle when it came to marketing and promotion. Again, everybody, even the guys who don't like Cassidy, everybody respects and acknowledges that Cassidy did a all-time great promo run for the month of April leading up to the battle. Nobody's ever seen a promo run like that before. It had it had the battle rap community on, on fire, the real BRC on fire, URL on fire, that whole month of April leading up to the battle between Cassidy and Goods. That was a legendary promo run by Cassidy. So Goods claiming that he's solely responsible for the battle reaching 2 million views in one week you're a goddamn fool. Now, did he play a part? Did he play a part in um, selling the battle? Leading up to the battle? No, he was AWOL. He wasn't promoting. Now, as far as his performance, um, you know, uh, and, and, and stage presence for that battle, I'll give him that. I'll give him that. He played a part in that role, but the, resp the views in, in, in terms of you know, URL having the most talked about battle in URL history. That's Cassidy versus Goods. These views, 2 million in one week, is solely responsible for Cassidy. I would say at least 90, 99% of it. 99% of it. You know what I'm saying? And, and couple of, a couple of angles I want to dismiss. Again, I, and, I, and I've said this before. You know, um... It's always, you know, Goods and, and, and the, guy, the guys who voted for Goods to win the battle. It's always they always talking about, oh, Cassidy has fans. Cassidy has fans. Cassidy has this. And again, I've always said, and I've always said this before, I am a battle rap fan first. There's a lot of fanboys on here that have their favorite battlers, and I get it. And I, I, I like a lot of, you know, I, I like a lot of battle rappers as well, but I'm a battle rap fan first, so I don't get blinded by or... I don't, I don't get blighted by the lack of objectivity when judging a battle because one of my favorite battle rappers is battling something else, somebody else. Case in point, um, A-Verb versus Loaded Lux. I watched that battle. A-Verb is one of my favorite battle rappers of all time. He is on my Mount, Ru Mount, uh, Mount Rushmore. And I have him losing that battle with Loaded Lux, 2-1. But like I said, it's a preference battle, 2-1 either way. You know what I'm saying? So... Um, I try to be objective when it comes to you know, watching battles and I don't, you know, have favoritism towards one battle versus one battler versus another. I just want to see a good battle. You know what I'm saying? And so, you know, the whole notion about, oh, yeah, Cassidy has fans. Cassidy has fans. Yeah, he got fans. But I would say the real BRC, um, you know, we don't have agendas. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of these guys, a lot of these bloggers these 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 battle rap bloggers they got agendas now because guess what they are they've been compromised by entities like url who who make sure they get exclusive content or make sure that they're protected because they're being funded by them they're being funded by the urls of the world to, to promote certain battlers and and, and, ca and cars and stuff like that so there's a certain interest which is why they have an agenda which is why they got to push a certain narrative you know what i'm saying for just casual battle rap fans or just the general public and, 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 and you know, the general public all, all around. They got to push the certain narratives and agendas and stuff like that. Um, I would say that, you know, especially for me, I, I don't do that. I try to be objective. So, um, yeah, I mean, going back to good saying that he's responsible for two million views in, one, in, one, in two weeks, two million views in one week, rather, flat out lie. Um, Another thing he said in a, in the Uncle Ra interview from 15 Minutes of Fame, he said, um, <laughs> and this was funny. Um, he he was he was talking about that Cassidy has bots, like he has bots and troll accounts. So all right, so if you go to the app, Goods is winning dramatically. 
right? Dramatic. It's a basically a landslide on the app. And I already told you guys that the uh, the the URL app voting system is trash because you can spam. You can vote as many times as you want to. You can go in and out of the video and keep voting up to 30 times and keep spamming. So you mean to tell me, based off that logic, if you're saying that the people in the comments section are troll accounts and, and bots, shouldn't you apply that logic to the app as well, right? Because you're winning in the app. So did a whole bunch of bots and trolls vote for you goods on the app? Come on, let's just keep it a buck. Like, call it down the middle. You know what I mean? So... You know, I've already told, I already went through checking my other videos about you know why I th think Cassidy won the battle. I already have Ca I originally had Cassidy winning. Well, I'll take that back. I originally had Cass Cassidy losing. When I first watched it on pay per view, I rewatched it. I said it's two one Cassidy. Then after this, after these bars that were stolen, I got Cassidy three zero. You know what I'm saying? He addressed the, he addressed the stolen bar, um, the stolen bar. That, that 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 Cassidy pointed out. He basically kind of like owned up to it, as far as how I interpret it. Like, listen, man, it's not. He was like, the the chauffeur line. Yeah, we used the same word, but it wasn't exactly the same. Yada yada. He said that uh the battle with um who 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 was that dude that uh did the transaction line. Um, I can't think of the name. I can't think of the dude's name off the top of my head, but um. He basically said that the battle or the line that he got the transaction line from or the battle they, that Cassidy pointed out, he said he didn't, he didn't watch that battle. He said he didn't watch that battle. Um, I don't think he addressed the line with Fred the Godson, um, but he was sitting right there. He didn't address that at all. I don't even know why he didn't mention Uncle Rod didn't mention that. And the Fred the Godson bar wasn't even brought up. He was sitting right next to Fred the Godson <laughs> with, with that bar. So, hey, to me, that's just, that's guilt right there. You basically acknowledge it. Yeah, I, I use the same verbiage. It's just not the same, but it's not really the same. So to me, he admitted guilt. And that's pretty much solidifies that Cassidy won the battle 3-0 to me. So I, I would like to see him address the Fred the Godson bar. And I would like to see Fred the Godson actually say something about that too. Because he was sitting right next to Fred the Godson. You know what I'm saying? So... But other than that, man, you know, if you're going to say that Cassidy got a whole bunch of bots and trolls voting for him, then apply that same logic to the app because you're winning by a landslide on the app. So that a whole bunch of bots and trolls, you know, what I'm saying vote for you. you. You just can't you can't just say that that Cassidy got a whole bunch of bots and trolls voting for him and, and leaving comments and leaving DMs and stuff like that. You can't just say that just the Cassidy fans. You got bots and trolls and, and, and for your for your fan base, too. Right. <laughs> so it is what it is man just wanted to share my thoughts about this video uh this latest interview with uh goods on 15 minutes of fame shout out to uncle Ra. you know what i'm saying so yeah they, I'm, I'm just reading the comments they're talking about the transaction line um let me see yeah, of course, transaction line. Um, Fred the Godson joint. Anyway, fam, those are my thoughts about that. Leave your comments down below. Till next time, family. Shanti signing out. Peace.